Not in the mood for Ugh. Hello. Yeah, I just wanted to remind you about the uh, lockdown drill tomorrow. That's right, 900 hours. And the key cards to activate the alarms are still in the safe in the security room. Yeah, same code. Six, nine, two, seven. Huh? Greetings, sir. That's enough for now. But I like listening to the radio. Are you on duty oh, tomorrow? Yeah. Why? Just wondered if you got the briefing on the lockdown drill tomorrow? I got it. I'll get issued one tomorrow morning. You know how it works? Because I don't. It's easy. I don't care. Two of us are stationed up here and below by the card reader. We get an alert, we both swipe our cards, and bingo. Lockdown. Well, what if the other guard is using the bathroom? Well, it's time. So if that should happen, I should be able to run down and activate the other swipe as well. But I guess that will need a little practice. Happy to not be at work tomorrow. Sounds like a lot of running around. It's what we're paid to do. Yeah, and it'll probably never happen. Just like fire drills. Yeah. Just like fire drills. The alarm. You need to act fast before those bastards evacuate. Head for the helipad. Der Helikopter macht nichts, Leute. Die kann man als Exit benutzen. Das wird wahrscheinlich irgendwas sein in die Richtung, aber da müssen wir noch irgendwas besorgen für, denke ich. Man kann die Leiche nicht verstecken, das ist auch scheiße. Naja, ist ja nicht bei der Bild. Ist ja erster, erster Run. We've left the helipad. Their last chance is by parachute. Make sure that doesn't happen. Which round is not a crime. 
Good Look 47. Good Look äh, Rotwild, danke schön. We got him, 47. Soon there will be no more Providence. You need to find an exit. Our business is done here, but it's far from over. Mal ein paar Punkte gemacht, wa? Freunde, Sorge. Oh, ich habe sogar eine Story-Mission gemacht. Ja, dann äh, machen wir mal weiter. your winning face i'd hate to see you lose we underestimated the constant yeah he's a glorified desk clerk he's not just after the money he wants it all we caught him once we can do it again and well we're not the ones who let him escape you still don't trust her i don't like executive decision makers look You don't have to follow her, you know? Soon, this will be over. Maybe it's time to think about the future. You have to face the possibility that there's no going back. If the ICA knows what you did... She'll make it right. She always does. We have a fix on Carlisle. Come on. We've got a plane to catch. I hope you like the rain, 47. Miss Burnwood. How did you... Burnwood. I have everyone's number. You really ought to know by now. You planned this. All of it. Don't be silly. I just played the hand I was dealt. And... We'll find you. You had me. Where'd that get you? We handed you an empire. It's for the best. The partners were complacent, set in their ways. But power is more than just security. Providence can be an agent of change. Surely you understand. Or you will. Soon enough. Diana is alt geworden, Leute. Todesfall in der Familie. Wie schwierig ist es in Berlin, eine bezahlbare Zwei-Zimmer-Wohnung zu finden? <lacht> She came home. Carlyle's lost an Empire. Fall hard enough, and you tend to be reminded of what truly matters. So 
So, the end of the line. You ready for this? Are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? <laughs> I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Das finde ich sehr, sehr schön. Alexa Carlyle is dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlyle, wisely sensing that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlyle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlyle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlyle, is cold as ice, tough as nails, and sharp as a razor. Incidentally, it was her late father who first brought the three families together after the end of World War II at this very house, meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. Maga, die sind so gut, die Level it began here, and it ends here. Talk about poetic. One more thing. Oh. According to our intel, Carlyle keeps a case file on the constant, information that may be helpful in his recapture, so don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. See you on the other side. Also Short Bruder, wenn dir die Lage egal ist und wie die Wohnung aussieht egal ist, dann äh, dann findest du schnell was. Aber wenn dir die Lage nicht egal ist und der Zustand nicht egal ist, ich glaube, dann ist es nicht ganz so trivial. Oh, der gibt mir ein Herz auf, Maga. Holy fuckeroni. Also, kannst du schon was finden, Happy End? So ist es nicht. Aber wie gesagt, ist nicht ganz so trivial. Also, meine Freundin hat in, äh, ich weiß gar nicht, zweieinhalb, glaube ich, gewohnt für 700 Euro. Aber da ist irgendwie... Fünfmal in der Woche die Heizung ausgefallen, kein warmes Wasser und äh, aber wird sich trotzdem schon was finden. Oh, mir fehlen die ganzen, die Silverballer, mir fehlen, mir fehlen alle. Was ist das? Oh, ich habe ja noch gar nichts. Keine Silverballer, Chat. Keine Silverballer. Ich hoffe mal, dass wir uns irgendwann noch mal mit dem Account verbinden können. Ich möchte meinen ganzen Shit haben. Aber bis dato macht es wirklich einen sehr schönen Thornbridge Eindruck. Thornbridge Manor. The Carlyle family's home for countless generations. The Revenant Alexa Carlyle and her three adult children Younger brother Zachary, grandson and daughter-in-law are all gathered to conduct Carlyle's sham funeral. Curiously, Carlyle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now, the target knows that you're coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. E? Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, Jet. Kannst du alles spielen? Hitman 1, Hitman 2, Hitman 3, kannst du alles spielen. Uh, das sieht gut aus. This is a private area, sir. Finish Whitmark. Private investigator. I have an appointment with Madame Carlyle. Please wait. 
Mr. Whitmer is here to see Madame Carlyle. You can go right in. That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator hired by Madame Carlyle this morning. I'm curious why he's here. Maybe you should do some detecting yourself, 47. Mr. Whitmer, thank God you're here. Can I take you to Madame Carlyle? Please do. If you'd follow me. I know I oughtn't say anything, but I'm so relieved you're here. Everything's just so strange. Okay. It's probably nothing, but... You know, why don't you just go and check it out? Copy that. Thumbs up, mate. Looking good, man. Looking good. Listen, sir, there's no drama. Just need to check your pop. Gets if you want to pass. Danke an euch alle für euren Support und eure Unterstützung. Und in diesem Sinne sage ich jetzt, ich bin weg. Tschüss, raus, peace, tschubi. Die Zemo, die Zema und Chat. Äh, Mats, danke schön für 15. This will just take a sec, sir. Yeah, hey. I know. Thank you. Mr. Whitmer, thank you for coming on such short notice. A great tragedy has fallen upon us, and I need a quick resolution handled with absolute discretion. Results and discretion are my speciality. Very well. I suppose you will want to start at the crime scene. In my experience, a thorough examination of a potential crime scene is half the job done. Good. Fernsby will take over from here. I am Mr. Fernsby, the butler. Madame Carlyle has asked me to assist you in any way possible. Mr. Whitmer, I understand that you've traveled from London. Would you care for some refreshments? Or do you prefer to go straight to Mr. Zachary's sleeping quarters? I prefer to get started. As you wish. If you'll follow me, sir. I feel obliged to point out that current affairs surrounding Madame Carlyle are of a delicate nature. You may be familiar with the recent announcement of her death. You will probably learn that the staged funeral is scheduled to take place tomorrow. Madame's children were not informed until this morning that their mother was in fact not dead at all. So please bear with them if they seem affected by the rather unusual situation. I trust I do not need to remind you that there will be consequences if word gets out that Madame Carlyle is still alive. I'll consider her dead when I leave. 
Danke an euch alle für euren Support und eure Unterstützung. Und in diesem Sinne sage ich jetzt, ich bin weg. Tschüss, raus, peace, chubi du. Short Router Gifted A Tier 1 Sub to DJ Crank. They have given zwei Gift Subs in the channel. dead in his bed this morning. The door was locked from the inside and a suicide letter was found in his room. However, Madame Carlyle suspects foul play and will not accept that he took his own life. I've prepared some information for you, so please do come and see me when you've finished your investigation of the crime scene. This is Mr. Zachary's room, to my right. A locked room murder mystery, 47. I trust you'll get to the bottom of this. A hidden door. Zachary was shopping for New Wellingtons last night. Not exactly what you would expect from someone suicidal. Zachary's suicide note. Also, a sample of handwriting. It could be relevant to compare to other samples to establish its authenticity. It's a secret passage. This could explain how the door was locked from the inside. Hmm, a photocopy of the floor plans. Somebody's been researching the secret ins and outs of Thornbridge Manor. I'm sure there's more to find in Zachary's room. Uh, Samstag uh, is Imola. Why don't you use your camera to scan the dead body, 47? Throat markings indicate a rare, short-lived plant poison killed him. Spread shows time of death at around 10 o'clock last night. You do know your poisons, 47. I believe you've done a thorough search of the crime scene, 47. Maybe it's time to see the butler. I'm curious about the information he's prepared for you. I know it can't last, but I don't just want another hookup. Very well, Mr. Fernsby. Make sure you focus on your work. I will. I don't need one more maid to cry. But he was such a gentleman. He gave me his coat and all. Rosie, you need to forget about Patrick. No good's gonna come of it. Stick to your own kind. You mean like Chris? He treated me like shit. All he wanted to do was play his stupid video games. Never any Romance. <laughs> Why did Alice tell me what Emma did when she arrived? What is it? Scheiß Gamer. 
for not making the bed. It's so unfair. She just discovered Zachary's dead body and was all On top of everything, Rosie thinks she's in love with young Patrick. I mean, that's a breaking heart happening if I ever saw one. Poor thing. And that detective asked to come here. <laughs> Hey, stream Priester, danke schön für dein Raid. Seedlings yesterday. Yes, sure. But he, he was upset believing his sister was dead. I'd say worried about how things would be handled with Gregory and Emma taking over. I said they let him stay. Now we'll never know. Oh my. You're taking this hard, aren't you? Broken lab equipment. It looks like it was recently used, though. Ich sehe schon wieder so viele Möglichkeiten hier. Ich glaube, das ist wahr, Bill. Er war hier, als er die Sache von Madame Carlyle auf der Flucht repariert hat. Eine Sache in Madame Carlyle's Office. Ich bete, das ist, wo sie die Sache auf Arthur Edwards hält. to inspect the arrangements for the staged funeral tomorrow. What's the delay? I'll never get rid of those stupid birds. I die in the autumn. I love autumn funerals. Madam Carlyle is dead, so there is no funeral. I still think it's going to be a beautiful funeral. I'm sorry with the undertaking. This one is wrong. This is of any fall auch eine quest, denk ich. Die Dings runterschießen. Äh, die Vögel, die drei Nester. Security detail at a staged funeral event tomorrow. <laughs> That'll be a first for me. I hope I can keep it straight. Hello, sir. 
Peace out, Maya. Thank <laughs> you.